Bonsoir les amis, this is uh, Lian Stanfield and today I would like to talk a little bit about Belgium. So did you ever want to go to Belgium? It's a very beautiful country. Um, or if you didn't quite want to go to Belgium, maybe you have friends who are from Belgium and they speak French. Or now with the internet, there's such a possibility that you speak French with someone but you don't really know where they're coming from. So you may be surprised at some expressions that people from Belgium um, are using. And um, of course, the most uh, powerful thing to do is to learn Parisian French, which is just another name for standard French. It's the language that, the French language that is understood um, all over the world. Um, and then if you are speaking to either um, a Canadian or a Belgian uh, or uh, someone from Switzerland, which we'll talk about tomorrow. So if you end up coming across uh, people from these countries and uh, you hear any expressions that you're not quite accustomed to, then you'll know what to do with them, right? Because you're going to learn uh, the idioms from that particular country. So on Sunday, uh, I will have um, a free webinar and it's called Francais Sunday. And um, I will talk a lot, a lot, with a lot of examples, a lot of very juicy, funny, um, even weird <laughs> um, idioms that you can find in different types of, you know, different French from different countries. But today I would like to talk about the Belgian, one of the Belgian uh, idioms. And uh, that can be a little confusing uh, because in Parisian French um, there is one way to say this and in Belgian French is another way to say uh, this particular expression. So Belgians would often say je ne sais pas le faire, je ne sais pas le faire. When in France you would say ce n'est pas possible or um, on ne peut pas le faire, ce n'est pas possible or on ne peut pas le faire. So uh, just to remind you that the transcript of this video is accessible, it's available in the Joalette uh, a Parisian French conversationalist Facebook group and the link to that will be under this video as soon as I finish this video and um, so I'm going to repeat again these um, this expression so a Belgian will say je ne sais pas le faire but a French from France will say ce n'est pas possible or on ne peut pas le faire so um, um, which means uh, it can't be done, it is not possible. So in French, standard French would be it is not possible, but in uh, Belgian French would be I don't know how to do it, uh, a literal translate, translation. So again, don't forget that the free webinar happens this Sunday at 6 p.m. Uh, New York time. And uh, if you want to learn about, you know, the link to go to when, you know, all the details, please go to parisianfrench.com. Uh, you subscribe for the, to the newsletter and this is how you find out through my newsletter um, when this is going to happen. Or, no, it's, it is 6 o'clock um, uh, p.m. Uh, New York time, yes, but uh, the actual link to access um, the free webinar and uh, if you cannot make it that's fine still subscribe still uh, come uh, on the link to to get the news and to find out the you know to get the link because if you are subscribed to the newsletter then I can send you uh, the replay link so even if you cannot make it then you're gonna have the replay link but if you can make it, and I strongly recommend that you do, um, well, there is a free, no, it's not free, there's a big huge bonus that I offer during during the webinar, but only during the webinar, so only if you come uh, during that per particular period of time when I'm uh, leading the webinar, uh, you will have the access to a link uh, to a great, great bonus that is fantastic. So, uh, don't ever give up on your dream to become bilingual. Learn Parisian French on Skype and travel the world. Merci beaucoup et à demain. Au revoir.